And the Colville Indian Reservation is a little over 1.3 million acres. Uh, we're made up of 12 tribes that have been moved to this reservation from as far away as, as Moses Lake, Wenatchee, and we've reorganized ourselves into one body called the Colville Confederation Tribes. When I came in in 1970, we had no businesses, we had no government contracts, we had no government grants or state grants, we had nothing. We totally survived off of timber, timber sales. And when that market died, we didn't have anything really. And so we got into gaming more. Gaming has allowed us to hire more people, allowed us to have a pot of money that we can supplement mental health, education. We put in hundreds of thousands of dollars into college and trade schools, two-year programs up through doctorate degrees. And we do that because we have a source of income now that's pretty steady, that allows us to develop. It has opened the door for us. We're in the process of finalizing our tribal government center that will centralize all our tribal government services and house all our employees in one central location. Some of the intangible benefits are going to be great and really be able to get all the services that our tribe provides with just one stop and I think that's going to help our membership tremendously. It's going to bring everyone together. It's, I think it's going to also improve our communications and allow us to work together better since we're all in the same spot. And we have all of the programs that a government would have to be a sovereign entity. Today, we've been able to build three clinics. We're looking at a joint venture to build a fourth clinic in OMAC. We built a whole new school, and it's a boarding school, not only for Colvilles, but other tribes also. We were the first tribe in the Northwest to have our own tribal convalescent center in the span of 40 years. What countries uh, and what governments make that sort of an advancement in that short a period of time? I do have two boys. One's uh, gonna graduate this year from high school and uh, we've talked about all the different opportunities with the tribe. So just continue to move forward in a, in a sound environmental way.